I realized that I didn't explain what I wanted my YouTube content to be. So here's what it's going to be. I want to do reactions and opinions. It's kind of a blend of the two. Reactions and opinions will always be in just like one category. And then I also want to eventually do reviews, and I'll get to that in a couple minutes. But what I wanted to explain was I want to be the kind of content that you listen to on your drive to work or home to the grocery store while you're making food, while you're giving your child a bath, stuff like that. I want to be a content creator that is... The, the channel is specifically for not watching. And it sounds strange, and it might sound boring to some people, but I remember when I was on my way to work or on my way home, I didn't always want to listen to music. I wanted to listen to game reviews. I wanted to listen to different videos, and I, of course, went to YouTube to listen to them. But I often found myself looking away for a second to see what they were talking about on the video. And even the ones where it's like uh, they don't even use a webcam or anything like that. It's just a gameplay video. It's a gameplay highlight, really. Like they're not going to show a video of them getting their getting completely destroyed. They're going to show a highlight like a. a uh, this week I had a really good match in Warzone, so I, this is what I'm going to put on this video. You know, even that can be distracting. And so I had this, I, this revelation, this idea, where it's like, I want to be content where this is really all that it's going to be. Because I want people to have a channel that they can go to where they can just listen. And... At the very most, on my review videos, I'm going to have a breakdown, but it's going to be a one-page summary breakdown. It's going to be on here, and it's never going to move. So at the beginning of the video to the end of the video, the page is just going to be there. You can read it at any time you want to. You can read it at the beginning, and then completely ignore what's visually going on on my channel the whole rest of the video. And I, want, I just want to have something that's safe for people to watch while they're driving, while they're jogging, while they're bike riding, while they're making dinner, all that stuff. They can just turn it on, listen to what I have to say, and they don't have to watch any of it. And so that's the type of content that I'm going for. And I'm sorry I didn't really talk about that sooner, because I'm sure quite a few people came in here and he's like, you know, they looked at it as, oh, this is very simple, you know, and it is, you're right. It is very simple, but I did that on purpose. I want it to be where you turn me on, you set the phone or tablet down, or you're playing a video game and you just put me on your second monitor just to listen to what I'm talking about while you're playing something. That's the kind of content I want to be. And so that's what I'm going for. Now, the second part of what I wanted to talk about was I. it was also another thing where I explored breaking down a review in its simplest form. And when you go into a review YouTube channel, the overall thing you're looking for is the expectation, the the expectation factor of that. Like you go into uh, a YouTube, uh, okay, let's back up for a second. You go into a YouTube channel and you look and they say, this game was absolutely horrible. You go into that to see why it was absolutely horrible and to get what their opinion was. Or you see somebody that says, this is one of the best games ever made. You're like, oh, why? So you go into that. Now, I thought that my rating system could be something that is in its simplest form. The overall expectation of the game. So, what expectation should you have for this game? Should you have a low expectation for the game? Should you have an average expectation, high, very high, or should you not play the game at all? No, don't don't even bother. So it's going to be an ex expectation rating system. And I'm going to break it down into five categories. The characters, the customization, and the classes, that'll all kind of be one thing. Then the gameplay, then 
crafting and weapon and inventory system, the voice acting, and the music. And so on each one of those, I'm going to say, expect, you know, you should really go into the music having low expectations, but the gameplay, you can have a very high expectation of really enjoying that. You know, that that's how I'm going to approach this. And it's all going to be on the screen the whole entire time. I'm never going to change the screen. And so you can literally just listen to what I have to say, and you'll never really have to look at the video. And that's what I'm going for with this. Um, and I hope you guys come to like it. I mean, I really do. And if you guys have any comments or any suggestions or anything like that, um, you can leave a comment below. Um, hopefully you guys liked uh, the idea of this because I know there's a lot of people that go out looking on YouTube and looking on Twitch, but you can also give me your opinions face-to-face -face on Twitch if you want to. Um, but uh, I know a lot of people that they listen to YouTube videos mostly um, when they're doing something and they put it on as like the background. They want to listen to what people are talking about, but they don't actually ever really watch it. But I haven't really seen that many video uh, content creators out here that do something like this specifically that actually go specifically for that that window of opportunity where I'm literally going to go out of my way to be somebody that you don't have to watch which is kind of strange in itself with a YouTube channel like I'm saying don't watch me just listen and yeah there are other types of content and other types of things out there that are similar but none that uh aren't distracting and that's what i'm going for i don't want people to be driving and look away from the road and look at my video while they're watching while they're listening to it while they're driving i don't want that and so i'm going out of my way to do my reviews and my reaction videos and all that um this way and obviously my twitch highlights those are meant to be watched but those are that's why they're Twitch highlights. They're called Twitch highlights. That's different. But my actual content that I'm making specifically for YouTube, I want it all to be the 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 content that you listen to, not the content that you watch. So hopefully you guys like the idea. And if you do, please leave a like. And if you don't like the idea, hey, I don't mind the dislikes. It it gives me a better idea of what most people want. And that's good for the growth of me and my channels and everything. So like or unlike, um, please leave a comment and please subscribe. I would love to get to a point where I'm eventually, you know, getting to some monetization. That would be really awesome. So I'm looking forward to that. And um, yeah, uh, I'll see you guys on the next one. All right. Later.